Hello, good evening. Hello, teacher, good evening. Hello. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hello. You hear me? Hi, good evening. Hi, everyone. Hey, good evening. My goodness, I cannot listen to you. Now? Hi, listen. can you hear me? Listen, me? listen. Yes, I hear you. Give me just a second. Hello, hello. Can you hear hello, me? Are you? Yes, yes, I hear you. Okay, awesome. Thank you. The thing is that okay. no, no les podía escuchar. I couldn't listen to you before. How are you? Oh. Hi. Awesome. Awesome. That's really good to hear. Okay. So thank you everybody for being here. Happy day, teacher. Thank you. Thank you, Natalie. Thank you very much. Uh, also, we have uh, Natalie Emerson and Mr. Molina. All right. So yes. how, how was your day? Tell me. Mm -hmm. It was very nice day. Oh, okay. Okay, that's uh, good. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's okay. That's Only... fine. <laughs> what about what about your your weekend? How was your weekend? Uh, the weekend. Yeah. Did you do anything interesting? Yes. I'm... Do you know the quarantine is only stay in the house nowadays, I know. right? Uh -huh. Yes, I know. It's really difficult, it's, actually. Uh, it's a little hard. I, I, I can change. I can I can change the situation. In the same in the same days, always. Yeah. But for did, the quarantine. did you go out? Oh no 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 yet I wait. Oh okay okay no I mean uh -huh. see, next, see. Uh -huh. yes. Next. Try to Next stay month. in the house. Oh yeah, okay. Next month probably, right? Yeah. Trying to uh -huh. try to stay in your house as long as necessary. That's really yeah. really important. Okay. Yes, of course. So thank you everybody for being here. Comenzamos la última semana. Okay. So we will be finishing by Thursday. Okay. And um, solamente voy a hacer un pequeño comercial antes de iniciar. Me comentaban por ahí que ya les mandaron el correo, recibieron un correo de invitación. Did you check it? Did you receive it? Ok. No, mm. teacher. No les han enviado todavía la invitación para inscribirse en el siguiente módulo. No, no yet. todavía no. Ah, ok. Bueno, entonces me adelanto un poquito para que ustedes lo comiencen a evaluar, alright? 
Para okay. el siguiente módulo los invitamos no tener una sesión de una hora solamente, que es bien limitada, right? Um, a okay. veces no tenemos suficiente tiempo para practicar. Entonces queremos hacerles la invitación para que se unan al programa de dos horas. Um, son dos horas diarias, es muchísima más práctica oral, all right? Uh, okay. so, sí se enfoca bastante en, en desarrollar todas las habilidades, pero eh, ayuda mucho a la parte de práctica oral porque se tiene más tiempo, más oportunidades de colaborar eh, y de socializar, right? que es bien importante. Okay. Eh, okay. Los horarios que en estos momentos les estamos ofertando son de 8 a 10 de la noche. Son dos horas, eh, por ahí pueden tener como un par de minutitos para levantarse y you uno know, para... Eh, Uh, ir por el café, you know? oh, no dormir, y, y seguir, sí. right? No, para no dor dormir, no. <risa> no, no so, dormir. Eh, se los adelanto un poquito para que ustedes lo consideren, eh, evalúen cómo están con el tiempo, yo creo que de 8 a 10, sería como una hora más, right? Lo que a veces eh, eh, utilizamos en ver televisión, las noticias, mm. Facebook, you know, Twitter. Um, entonces, podemos comenzar como a considerarlo en un par de... de Creería que esta semana les están enviando la nota, eh, la nota de inscripción para que ustedes consideren si, si les es favorable. Eh, inicialmente, eh, sí, déjeme ver. Adriana pregunta que siempre en la noche de 8 a 10. Sí, siempre en la noche. Ese es el horario que nosotros les ofertamos en el momento. Yo sí les recomiendo ese programa de dos horas. Porque a veces con una hora nos quedamos, uy, no, no me alcanzó el tiempo para escucharlos a todos, ¿all right? O el no día. tuve el tiempo de, exacto, o a veces necesitamos escribir algo, revisar gramática, pero luego vamos a la práctica. O listening, por ejemplo, a veces necesitamos que alguien nos guíe con la parte de listening. Entonces, sí se los recomiendo. Déjenme solo confirmar el horario. Eh, permítanme un segundito. Ok, hold on. Give me just a quick second. Eh, les comparto el horario. Sí, creería que ya les, pensé que ya les había llegado. Um, el horario, sí se está ofertando el módulo. No es para todos, pero para el de ustedes, sí. Son dos horas de clase, de lunes a viernes. Ya no sería de lunes a jueves, sino de lunes a viernes. All right. Eh, well, Ustedes ya están en el teléfono o en la computadora y este es como el requisito principal. Y luego completar el proceso de inscripción y un 80% de asistencia obligatoria. Yo sé que ustedes han sido muy responsables y les agradezco por notificar cuando no han podido asistir, que eso es bien importante para saber cómo están. Eh, Blanca me pregunta que cuánto dura el módulo. Déjenme revisar. Ustedes son... Well, los chicos se los van a brindar, les van a brindar el dato preciso. No estoy, no recuerdo, no, no les quiero mentir, right? <ríe> uh, o darle información errónea. Creería que son 40 horas. But eh, los chicos que, que les brinden a ustedes el dato, les van a confirmar. O déjenme preguntar el día de mañana y yo les confirmo. No estoy segura si siempre son las cuatro, las cuatro semanas que hemos manejado. O sea, um, uh, es una, una semana más porque ustedes ya estarían entrando a intermedio, right? So necesita mucha más práctica oral. Eh, ah, Blanca me dice que ya lo enviaron. Entonces, chicos, revisen su correo, please. Dice que ya enviaron, les enviaron de 6 a 8 y de 8 a 10 de la noche. El programa no, eh, ya no estaría disponible. Eh, por el momento nos pidieron que se lo socializáramos, que les compartiéramos eh, este módulo o, o esta propuesta. Tendría que confirmarles eh, si el de una hora seguiría, pero, pero sí, les, les, definitivamente les recomendamos el de dos horas para que avancen y um, aprendan inglés, ¿verdad? Muchísimo más rápido, de una forma más fluida y que al final es el objetivo de todos, poder hablar inglés sin, sin trabarnos tanto, right? Tener muchísima más fluidez, más vocabulario. And um, pretty much that's it. Sí, uh, sí, Blanca, les, les han recomendado en el correo dos horarios, de 6 a 8 y de 8 a 10. Um, yo les recomiendo el de 8 a 10 porque sé que a las 6 algunos van llegando a sus casas, you know, apenas eh, van bien cansados, necesitan cambiarse ropa, por ejemplo, uh, o, o hacer la cena, you know. En, entonces a las 10 ya estamos como más tranquilos, ya hicimos lo que vamos a hacer en el día 
y ya estamos esperando irnos a dormir, right? So, considérenlo, all right? Valórenlo and, y se los dejo. Y si ya tienen, si ya lo pensaron, pues me regalan eh, la confirmación, right? De qué módulo, eh, qué horario escogerían. Solo quedo pendiente de confirmarles la duración, si son cuatro o cinco semanas. Se los confirmo en el grupo, all right? No sé si alguien a mí, tiene preguntas. A mí no me han mandado el correo. No se lo han mandado. A mí no me ha llegado el correo. Mm, bueno, si gusta, eh, no, escriba, no, no, escríbame no, no, en el no, grupo. No, 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 no. Ah, vaya, perfecto. Gracias, Claudia. So, si no le han llegado, eh, por favor, mándenme un, un correo o un mensaje en el grupo para hacérselo llegar al encargado y que ellos puedan okay. coordinar la entrega. All right. De acuerdo. So, I'm sorry, that was a commercial. <laughs> okay, I'm going to, I'm sorry for the stealing your time. So we are going to start session number 13 today. And this is like, keep calm and learn English. Okay, so I really like this phrase. Okay, uh, today we are going to be talking about future activities using the going to. Por ahí leí que algunos ya avanzaron, así que congrats. Les debo el dulce, ya se los voy a ir mandando. Yo voy a revisar quienes terminaron, all right? So we are going to be using this. Uh, first of all, I want you to uh, watch a video. Algunos ya lo vieron, right? Some of you have already um, checked this out. Pero otros todavía estamos como en el proceso de revisar um, session number five. So uh, I want you to, I'm, I'm going to share a video here. Vamos a verlo, es super corto, super, super short. And then uh, vamos a practicar a little bit. So give me just a second. Okay. Solo me ayudan confirmándome, please, si lo logran escuchar. Can you listen to her? Hi. Yes, teacher. Yes? Okay, yes, teacher. perfect. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So let's listen to her. So are you ready to talk about future plans? Good for you. I want you to take notes as you listen to the audio program and don't go as we'll stay and explain the use of future with present continuous and the use of future with be going to. Page 101, exercise three, grammar focus. Future with present continuous and be going to. With present continuous. What are you doing tonight? I'm going to a soccer match. Are you doing anything tomorrow? No, I'm not. With be going to plus verb. What is she going to do tomorrow? She's going to work until five. Are they going to go bowling? Yes, they are. As you could see, we have two possible ways to express future. We may use present continuous as well as be going to to talk about it. It is important to know that we may use present continuous and be going to when we plan actions in the future. Also, when we're certain that something is going to happen in the future. We want you to know as well that when we predict, we do not use present continuous, instead we use be going to. Read the examples with me. Be going to, to make predictions. Watch out, you're going to break the glass. It's so cloudy, I think it's going to rain. Now let's go over the form of present continuous. Subject plus verb to be, um, are, is plus verb plus ing. Examples. She's watching a movie. They're going to the concert. These are the steps to follow when making an affirmative statement. And if the statement is negative, we add the word not between be and the verb plus ing. This is the form when using be going to. Subject plus verb to be, um, are, is, plus going to, plus infinitive verb. Examples, I am going to play handball. He's going to cook. These are the steps to follow when making an affirmative statement. And if the statement is negative, we add the word not between be and going to. And when you want to ask a friend or a relative about their plans, you may do so by asking using a WH question word like this. WH question word plus be plus subject plus verb plus ing plus complement and question mark. Where are you celebrating your graduation? What is he doing tonight? Remember, your WH question word will depend on what you want to know. Or you may ask like this, 
wh question word plus b plus subject plus going to plus infinitive verb plus complement and question mark where are you going to celebrate your graduation Okay, everybody, so I will stop the video right there so we have the chance uh, to practice. Let me share the presentation one more time here. Okay, here we go. So um, you listen in the video that we can use or we can express the, the future, okay, in two different ways. Actually, I various formats, right? The most common are present continuous and be going to. So we're going to is para planes, right? We use it for plan. And here you have it. Like for example, tomorrow. What are you going to do tomorrow? And you have the structure. I am going to, I am going to, well, I'm not going to go to the beach, right? I mean, we are in quarantine, so no. Uh, maybe I am going to wash the dishes. I am going to work, okay? So that is pretty much my plan. So the things that I want to do. I want you to, uh, well, you're going to help me with this. Here we have be going to for intentions and predictions. So what is going to happen? I want you to help me with this, okay? Take a look at this. Take a look at this picture, okay? What are they going to do? Can I have some volunteers? Can I have some takers? So remember okay. plans, yes? They're going to camp. Okay, they're going to go camping, thank you. Any other possibility, volunteer? They are going to play. They're going to play, all right. Uh, all right, so, okay, I believe the sound is too deafening. <laughs> okay, give me a second. So take a look at this. Uh, what they're going to do? Well, they are going to Go camping, you say? Okay, that's quite fine, okay. Um, all right, hold on a second. What about this one? What is going to happen? What do you think? He is going to drive in. Okay, he's going to drive, thank you. Any other volunteer? Take a look at this person, okay? Take a look at the at the bus also. What do you think is going to happen? So, ¿qué va a pasar, right? Daniel. An accident. Oh, so they are going to have an accident, okay? They are going to have an accident. Thank you. All right. What about this person? What do you think is going to happen? <laughs> He's going to do pictures. All right, so maybe he's going to take some pictures. Okay, very good. All right, any other possibility? That's okay. <laughs> All right, what about in this picture? What is he going to do? He's going to watch. He's going to watch TV. Oh, he's going to watch TV, all right? Help me, what is he going to watch on the TV? So what? He is going to watch a game. Okay, he's going to watch maybe a game, all right? Maybe a soccer match, okay? Any other possibility? He's going, he going to, do, to see a... A movie, maybe? Okay, okay. So maybe he's going to watch a movie, all right? A soccer match, okay? Maybe a soap opera. Yes. 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 <laughs> oh, that was your idea. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. So maybe he's going to watch a soap opera, una novela, right? So can you help me with names of soap operas? Do you watch soap operas? No. No, I don't. No, I know. You don't, okay. Uh, any any idea? Tell me a name of a soap opera. My grandma, yes. It's like, um, I think in the 70s or 80s, a soap is like a... What is... Oh, yes, yes. Soap yes. is jabón. Yes. But soap opera juntos son novelas. Uh -huh. Soap opera. Exactly. So, yes. The meaning, it's a frazzle there for, or a name for um, the novela. Yes. In the United States. 
Yeah, soap, only soap, es el jabón. But when you listen to soap opera, so la palabra combinada es una novela. Yes. yes. All right. So it's like a theory, okay? Like a theory okay. in, in the, all of these things. American uh, things that we normally watch, like Supernatural, Doctor House, they are serious. But in Latin American, le llamamos soap opera. So, son novelas para nosotros, right? More drama. <laughs> okay. So, maybe he's going to watch a soap opera. Okay. Uh, Mr. Molina, ¿cuál novela ve? No, I, I don't see a soap opera. Oh, come on. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Volunteers who watches uh, a soap opera. Or give me an example, okay? De las que su abuelita ve, you know. Not necessarily you, right? <laughs> okay, uh, La Rosa de Guadalupe. Right? Okay, perfect. So, La Rosa de Guadalupe. So, maybe this person is going to watch La Rosa de Guadalupe, Rosa okay? De Guadalupe. That's okay. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> um, now, what do you think is going to happen here? So, take a look at this. What is Tom going to do? He's going to watch uh, Okay, so he's going to wa uh, wash the car. Okay, very good. I would say, yes, Yvette? Wash the car. Okay, so he's going to wash the car. Give me, I'm sorry, give me just a second. Okay, so he's going to wash the car. Any other volunteer? He's going to try to wash the car. Oh, he's going to try, okay, because there is like a goat. There is a little animal right there. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Oh, what about this person? Take a look at it. So, me siento identificada. I feel like this all the time. So, what is going to happen? Maybe he's going yeah. late to work. Oh, very yeah. good. Okay, he's going to arrive late. Any other volunteer? He's going to hurry hurry up. He's going to hurry up. Okay. Uh, how can I say lo van a despedir? Uh, firework. Ah, okay. So maybe he is going to be fired. Okay. So that's a possibility, right? So not necessarily it's going to happen. All right. <laughs> what is Calvin? Have you ever seen Calvin? ¿Alguna vez leyeron los cartoons? Yeah. Have you ever seen them? Okay. So what is Calvin going to do? What do you think? ¿Qué va a hacer? Copy. Uh, okay. Okay. So, okay. Let Calvin me is going to copy uh, the exam. Okay. So there is a word that I want to share here in the chat that is cheat on. Okay. Cheat on means oh. uh, que va a ser trampa, right? So maybe oh. he's, he is going to cheat on the exam. Oh. All right. Yes. So, okay, okay, okay. And maybe she is going to punish Calvin. Okay. So, lo va a castigar, right? She is going to punish. Let me share that word also with you. That is punish. Okay, there you go. So, those are the possibilities. Um, what is she going to do? I would like to listen to more people. I have here some people who has not like participated. I haven't heard. Leo, Mr. Orellana, hello. Leo Orellana, are, are you here? Hi. Maybe not. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, Melvin, hello. Melvin. Hi. Hello, good night. Ah, hello, hello, hello. Hello, can hello. You, How are you? Can, I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Melvin, help me with this one. What are you going to do? Well, what is she going to do? She's baking bread. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, Remember that the... Okay, that's a very good one. So she is uh, baking bread. Bread, okay, that's okay. What about in the future? ¿Qué va a hacer? What is she going to do? Um, we are going to use, uh, let's try to use be going to, okay? Let's try to use be going to for plans. Like she is going to, but very good job, Melvin. Actually, you're totally right. Um, okay, so what is going to happen? Take a look at this picture. Thank you, Melvin. Can I have another volunteer? Um, thank you, Roberto. Okay, so what is going to happen? So, ¿qué va a pasar? What is going to happen? Uh, he's, 
he's, he, he he's going to... Uh, yes, yes, yes. Almost, almost there. Uh, uh -huh. <laughs> they, the rain? Rain. Very good. Okay, there you go. So it is going to rain, va a llover, right? So I'm not sure, pero estoy como 80% segura, right? Mm -hmm. So it is going to rain, va a llover, all right? Very good. Um, okay, so take a look at this one. Now let me admit it. Okay, take a look at this. What is he going to do? going to take a shower very good he's going to take a shower and he's ready you know with the soap with the duck plastic duck okay so yeah so he's going to take a shower okay it will rain blanca yes blanca that's another way to say that okay very good so um do you have an equation be going to is bastante fácil it's super easy porque solamente seguimos like it is going to i am going to you are going to and that's it, okay? No hay cambios en el verbo. So pretty much that's it. Now, let's think about something negative. Ahora hagamos sobre cosas que no van a suceder. Take a look at this picture, okay? First, díganme algo que va a suceder. What is going to happen in the picture? ¿Qué va a suceder? Yes? He, 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 he going to call the... the Fire a cuerpo bombero. Fire, ah, okay. fire more. Uh, okay. Fire. No, you're you're right. To die. Okay. So he's going to call the firefighters. Ahora, fire. hagamos, hagamos la misma oración negativa, please. Help me to make it negative. Solo le agregamos un not. He is not going to call. Awesome. Very good. Mm -hmm. So he is not mm -hmm. going to call the firefighters. Okay. Very good. That's okay. Uh, we already saw one about that, okay? Uh, next one, so, ¿qué va a hacer? What are, what are you going to do? Or what is he going to do? He's going to travel. He's going to travel, very good. Now, algo que no vaya a hacer, something he's not going to do? He's not he's going, not to, going go to go airport. home. He's not going to? Uh, I'm sorry. Okay, he is not going to the airport. Okay, Emerson, I'm going with you. Can you repeat, please, Emerson? He is not going to drive a car. Oh, okay, very good. He's not going to drive a car. Yes, that's very good. Um, so, how do you say caerse? Fall down. Fall down, very good. So, what is going to happen? going to fall down. He is going to fall down. And como es un huevito, he's going to, he's going to break, okay? Break. <laughs> yeah, he's going to break. Poor little egg. Okay, so what we are going to do right now is the following. Uh, okay, so I have Blanca. I believe she's sick. But thank you, Blanca. Gracias por estar acá con nosotros, a pesar que se siente un poquito mal. So he is going to travel. He isn't going to travel. Very good grammar. That's okay, Blanca. All right. Now, what we are going to do is this. Imagine, okay, that you are a fortune teller. Imagine that pueden predecir el futuro por un segundo, all right? And um, so you are going to tell your classmate, okay, los, uh, lo que le va a suceder en el futuro. What is going to happen? Lo vamos a hacer right now with going to, como si fuera un plan de ustedes hacia ellos, all right? For example, please, um, díganme que, que voy a ser rica, okay? <laughs> you are going to be rich. Oh, yes, awesome, okay, very good. So that's exactly the way we will do it, okay? Vamos a decirles obviamente cosas positivas, right? No cosas negativas ni catastróficas or anything. So, okay, you're going to be rich. What else? Give me more um, ideas or predictions. Let's call it predictions right now, okay? So, anything else? We oh. are learning uh -huh. English. Okay, so you're going to learn English fast. I'm sorry, creo que escuché a alguien, but uh, estaba muy suave. I couldn't listen to it to the previous person very well. Who was that? 
¿Quién estaba hablando anterior, chicos? Did, did you identify the person? Roxana, right? Yeah. I'm sorry, Roxana, casi no se le escucha. But, but tell me, tell me. Hi, Roxana. Hello. <laughs> I don't know if it's me. ¿Alguien escuchó a Roxana? Did you listen to her? No, teacher. No. Yeah. No, okay. O, o Roxana, eh, lo puede escribir en el chat también, if you're having issues, no se preocupe. You can share that as well. Okay, so I am going to be rich, okay. Um, me quedo con esa, all right. But give me more ideas. ¿Qué más? What else? We Remember. To, yes, Roberto. We are going to complete the English platform. Hey, yes. You're going to complete the English platform. No, no solo la plataforma. You're going to complete the whole course, <laughs> okay. So okay. advanced, TOEFL, okay. So you're going to complete it, okay. Uh, anything else? You're going to ooh, read what Roxana uh, wrote in the chat. She says, you are going to win the lottery. Yes. Yes, Roxana, I really hope so. But not for a dollar, right? <laughs> okay, I really hope so. So this is what we will be doing. Uh, do you have any questions? Questions, questions? I have a question, teacher. In this what? sentence, what is going to happen? What what happened with the pronouns? Oh. No. Oh, here in the question, what is going to happen? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, okay. Later, van a ver algo que se llama eh, subject and object questions. Algunas veces no se tiene un pronombre porque no se sabe exactamente. All right. Mm. And uh, so hay como dos tipos de preguntas, pero lo van a ver luego. Así que no se preocupen. No worries about it. So what is okay. going to happen? Es como, ¿qué va a pasar? Uh -huh. Sí. So, pero el sujeto uh -huh. es como este what. No, no worries. Uh -huh. Ya lo van a estudiar. Okay. okay. Um, so, uh, but preguntas como utilizar be going to. Do you have an equation? No. No. Feel, feel free, okay, to express questions, ideas, comments. Okay, very good. If no questions, vamos a irnos a la parte de práctica, which is super important. Um, so, what I want you to do is this. Necesito que le deseen cosas muy positivas a sus compañeros, all right? Especially because now with this quarantine, lockdown, coronavirus, todos andamos como medio negativos, right? So, Deseemos, deseemos, all right? Let's hope, okay? Um, let's give some positive vibes, positive energy to your classmates. Pueden inventar, okay? So be creative. Like, for example, Adriana is going to have two babies in the future. Um, I don't know. Claudia is going to get married soon, okay? Uh, Leo Orellana is going to be the next president of El Salvador. So, I mean, be creative, okay? Let's give some a little bit of um, good vibes, you know, and olvidemos un poquito what is going on outside. So I'm going to invite you to join the group, okay? And uh, so I will give you, okay, no, no problem, Blanca. Thank you very much. Thank you for being here. Espero que se recupere, all right? No problem. So I will give you five minutes, unamonos al grupo, y luego regresamos, all right?
maybe I going to take a shower after the class. Okay. 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 For sleep more comfortable. Hi everyone. How you do? How are you doing here? Okay. So. Uh, also, remember that the idea is que le decimos al compañero también, you know, that we guess, all right, que le digamos un par de predicciones, like positive stuff, okay? okay. <laughs> so, what do you okay. think is going to happen? So, ¿qué, qué, ¿qué va a pasar en sus vidas? What is going to happen in your life? I tell you to my partners, I'm going to sleep at 11 p.m. Today? Today. Oh, okay, okay, that's all right. So that's your plan, right? What about these girls? Tell them something positive. También dígales, compárteles un par de cosas que espera para ellas, right? Something that you're expecting for them. Okay. Okay. Uh, Melvin, Melvin is going to travel in December. Where? Oh my god. <laughs> Maybe uh, Paris. Oh, awesome. Okay. And, and by December, that sounds great because the, hopefully the coronavirus is going to be over. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I, I like it. I like it. What about you girls? Uh, Natalie? Um, <clears throat> sorry. It's okay. Uh, Roxana? Um, he, she going to get married oh. <laughs> this year. <laughs> Listen to her. Yeah, okay. This year. No, not possible. Good, good desire. Good desire. Uh, okay. So I'm sorry, Natalie. Did you say this year or next year? This year. Oh my God. <laughs> when? <Not> when? <laughs> be, be a specific. Uh, when, girl? October. <laughs> In October. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. So, Roxana, you said that that is not possible. Why? Mm, no, because I, I don't like Mary yet. Oh, but who knows? By by October, so we have like uh, three months. <laughs> maybe, maybe next year or next next. Year. Ooh, okay. 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 I like it. That's that pretty good okay okay what about your predictions for melting um for melting a lot money please <clears throat> money <laughs> a lot money green lottery and new car please. oh going money money to, he going to have two kids oh, oh. Or, and twins. For next year. <laughs> actually, actually, I have now two kids. Wow, so a you're going to have four. Years, a boy 15 years and a girl 10 years. Wow. Oh, so okay. have two kids now. So Natalie says that you will have two more kids. Okay, so that will be four. <laughs> no, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. No. That's so funny. Okay, I'll give you two more minutes. So keep on practicing. Very good job. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Hi, girls. How are you? Uh, we're practicing. Okay. okay, okay, now perfect, that's all right. So what are your um, wishes, let's call it that way, or your predictions for your classmates? What is going to happen, you know, about each I'm other? Gonna, I am going to be good in the, how to say it's examined? In the, well, if it, it, yeah, in a test, in a final exam, in my evaluations, the, the, any way you want to call it. Uh -huh. What in my I, I want to ask you something. Yes. About the plataforma. Oh, okay, okay. Go, go, go. Shoot okay. it. I, I want to be honest with with me and then with you guys. Okay. I 
I I did my second test, I think, from the okay. adjectives or the adjectives or something like that. Okay, comparative. And I didn't. Uh -huh, and I didn't read the sentences. O sea, I didn't read the instructions. Okay. And what and happened? I just, and I just spelled the first time. I just spelled the answers, and it wasn't. It wasn't like that way. It was. I had to write the answer, but I have to follow writing all the sense. And was it marked down? Yeah. I decía the the la 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 puntuación mía. Yeah. Zero de treinta y tres. Oh, okay. Okay. Y luego, and then I write out the instructions, mm -hmm. read out the instructions, and I I and, understand mm -hmm. what what they say, but okay. but I try to make it after I I see the video. Okay. Like um, but after the coma and ho however. Um, al final de la oración. Oh, you are in part number one with uh, yeah. though, however. But, mm -hmm. yeah. but I try to make it my all best and okay. siempre decía la misma puntuación. No sé si porque este ya lo había hecho mal la primera vez porque no, no leí las instrucciones or I, it was all wrong. I don't know that. But I don't think so because... Um. I saw the video mm -hmm. and I listened to the video. And, and you followed the I structure. Uh -huh, but I think I want to know that if, if I was, all my answers were wrong or or it's because I I spelled down the first time. Yeah, I got to. I totally understand. Do me a favor. Uh, take a, if you have the chance to go to that part, to go to the section, take a screenshot and send me uh Send me what you get, because in that case, I can ask the the person in charge, you know, what uh, yeah, the best way to follow. Mm -hmm. I, I know first, before you do something or write something, you have to read the instructions. But I saw the, <laughs> the exercise the, yeah. and then I read the instructions. <laughs> yeah, no worries. It happens. It, ha it has okay. happened to all of us. It's fine. No worries. Uh, so, but let's do that. Uh, take a screenshot, send it to me, and uh, just to, to double check if the sentences are okay, or just to check if there is like an extra space, and then uh, so I can request some help from uh, okay. support. Mm -hmm. That's okay. Not, okay, not a problem. But I have to send it to the WhatsApp or, or, or where? Yeah, you can because send it. To I don't have too. a computer. Oh, no, no worries. You can send it, um, but I believe in the, the platform, you check it from your cell phone. Oh, okay. Or no. Thanks. Where do you check the platform? In Google. I went to Google. But in your cell phone or in the computer? Yeah. No, in my cell phone. Oh, it's okay. So when you get there, just take a screenshot, like a normal picture, right? From a phone. Oh, okay. And, and send okay. it to the WhatsApp group. Mm -hmm. That's okay. That's okay. Okay. And I will take Thank care you. of it. No worries. That's okay. Um, okay, I'm sorry to interrupt. I believe it is the time for us to go back. So let's join the, the, the main station, please. I'll see you in a second. All right, everybody, thank you very much for joining. Creería que nos faltan todavía cinco. I'm missing five more people to join. How was your practice? In my team, good. Okay, good. That is really nice to hear. Okay, I heard really good predictions about you guys. And, and uh, well, first, I would like to, to, I would like you to share some of the things that you heard, okay? Because for me, it was, uh, I had a lot of fun listening to you guys. So can, can you share some of the predictions your classmates made about you? 
So, ¿qué les desearon? Or, what did they say about you? For example, I think it was Melvin, the one I was listening to. Melvin, are, are you around? Yes. Okay. W would you please, uh, do you mind sharing with your classmates? ¿Qué fue lo que le desearon las, las compañeras? What did they say about you? My classmate decided for me two kids more. Okay. <laughs> so they said that Melvin, Melvin is going to have two more kids. Okay. So, and I think it was Roxana. Four totally. Okay, four in total. So, and Roxana is going to have babies, right? No, she is. No. <laughs> what, what is going to happen in the future? Yes. Mary. Yes. I, oh. Yes, I desire for her, Natalie and Roxana. Yeah, going to true. be pregnant. Oh, they are going to be pregnant. Okay, and they are going to get married this year. Okay, please, no se quiten a la boda. <laughs> okay, so please invite us. Okay, yes. Okay, what about the rest of you? Escucharon el, algo like something that was fun for you? Alguien quiere compartir like your uh, what your classmates said about your future? Or your own plans. Si tienen ya algún plan establecido, like what's your plan? Lisa, thank you. Hi. <laughs> hi, hi there. Hi. So uh, what's your plan? We're talking about with my classmate Luis. Um, we talking about prediction. And okay. he is going to finishes the English course and he is going to to do the exam to the software. Yes. And he's going to, to do that degree about English. Hey, awesome. Seriously, Luis, are you thinking about going for the licenciatura for the major? It's a prediction. Or no. Oh, well, I love it, but still, I think it's super, super yes. cool. Okay, mm -hmm. that's a really good one. Okay, anybody else? Thank you very much, Lisette. Okay, girls, what okay. about you? Thanks. I'm missing Claudia, Leti. Leti, hello, Miss Orellana, no le he escuchado. How are you? Hi, how are you? Hi there. Uh, so tell us, oh, what fine. are your plans or what are your predictions for your classmates? Yeah, with Yvette, we're talking about, uh, I'm going to be cook a pizza, okay? okay. She's going to drive a car. Okay. <laughs> it's just a uh, sentence. Amen. Normal sentences, right? Okay. No, but that is okay. That's just fine. Very good uh, use of grammar. Uh, That's good. And for tonight, it's going to be rain late. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, yeah. I think that's possible, you um, know. So, yeah, it, it is going to rain, okay? Or maybe it is going to be windy, right? Like, con vientos and all that stuff. Okay? Yeah. Okay? Awesome. Okay. Thank you for sharing. Okay, everybody. So, we have a couple of minutes and we will go for the free section here. Okay, give me a second. We are going to be discussing these questions, okay? Previously, it was just predictions, okay? So, vamos a movernos un poquito con a little bit more about yourself, okay? I have five questions here. Number one says, what are you going to do with your life? This is a very hard question, okay? ¿Qué van a hacer con su vida? <laughs> so, what are your plans, okay? Uh, some said, for example, nunca me voy a casar. I'm not going to get married. I'm not going to have babies. I am, or I'm going to travel. I'm going to live in another country. So what are you going to do with your life? ¿Cuáles son sus planes, right? Are you going to meet anyone at the weekend? All right. ¿Van a encontrarse con alguien? Please say no. We are in quarantine. Okay. <laughs> so are you going to meet anyone at the weekend? Um, are you going to watch television tonight? If your answer is yes, so give details. ¿Qué van a ver? What are you going to watch? Okay. What book are you going to read next? Si leen, of course. If you don't read, that's fine. And where are you going to give up your bad habits? I'm sorry, when are you going to give up? Give up significa like, si tengo un mal hábito, ¿cuándo lo voy a dejar? Right? 
for example, if I eat a lot of candy, so that I think that's a bad habit. So when are you going to give it up? Cuando lo voy a dejar, all right? Or if my bad habit is not doing exercise, so cuando voy a cambiarlo, right? So when are we going to change it? Um, do you have any question here with the vocabulary? No, we're good, we're ready. No, yes, teacher, ready. no question. Yes, teacher, I'm ready. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry, who has a question? I heard somebody said I have a question. Okay, maybe not. Okay, perfect. So I will give you five minutes free discussion, okay? And then I will select some people to, to volunteer, <laughs> okay? Uh, give me just a second. Okay, so here we go. Okay, give me just a second, give me just a second. Okay, so please join the session. Five minutes and we finish, all right? So five more minutes y luego los traigo de regreso. So let's get started, please. with a flight attendant and <clears throat> maybe travel travel around the world and okay. excuse me okay okay and and maybe live in another country Awesome, it sounds good to me. Where are you going to live? Hi, hi teacher. Oh, you're and doing a good job. Continue, please. Maybe in, um, I don't know, perdón, ¿cómo se llama? I don't remember the, the name of the, of the country. Uh, where is the country? In America and in, no, in Europe? Europe. Europe, um, oh, Belgica. Ah, oh, Belgium. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Yes. Okay. It sounds really good to me. Okay. Perfect. Thank you, Natalie. Uh, Yvette, what about you? What are your What are you going to do with your life? I want to be. I want to learn a lot of English. <laughs> That's the first one. Okay. Then, okay. Then I want to get a a job. Um, and I want to live in another country too. All right. And I won't get married <laughs> another time. <laughs> oh, okay. Another time. So you're being very specific. Okay. Um, it, it called my attention. You said that you want to get a job. Do you mean like another job, a different type of job? What do you mean? Well, I really i need a really job i know what i do i make cake 
Oh, you're a baker. Yeah. Oh. But I I do it by my house. Um, I mean, but that, you're an entrepreneur, so that is even better. <laughs> you are your yeah, own but, boss. Yeah, yeah. But <laughs> I need, um, a really job because um, I have two daughters. One is 15 wow. and the other one is 10 years old. Oh, they are teenagers. So, yeah, so they have to study too. And, and what? I, I'm sorry to interrupt. Continue, please. And so I have to get some more money. <laughs> oh, I understand, I understand. So um, what's, what's the type of job that you would like to get? Well, actually I'm learning uh, English because I want to work in maybe in a call center. All right, okay. I, I want to work in, in something that I like. Okay. And I, okay. I really like English. Awesome. Okay. It sounds really good to me. So keep working on it, girl. I'm pretty sure that you will make it. So you're, okay. you're, you two girls are speaking English nicely, very fluently, uh, with a very nice intonation and pronunciation. So I'm pretty sure that you will make it. Just wait six okay. more, six months at the most. And I see you already in the call center, you know. So you will say my so. fault. <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure. I hope so because I'm pretty sure you can I have make it. problems with my nerves. Sometimes I know what the word means, but I'm nervous and my nerves don't help me. I totally relate to that. I understand. But you know, when when uh, the more you practice, the more confident you get. So whenever you have the opportunity to speak to somebody, go ahead. You know and if you make a mistake, it's, it's okay. So nobody is going to die, you know? And that's very important. So making mistakes is part of the process. So yeah, you can not, definitely not, make it. I'm not a woman that, um, que se estanca donde está, sino que se cae y se tiene que volver a levantar. Awesome, awesome, yeah. okay. That, that's actually the, the, what has to move us, right? To, yeah. to overcome difficulties. And, and, and right now we are facing a really big one, but I'm pretty sure that we will get over this soon, okay? But yes, yeah, so if that is your, your goal, go for it. So don't let anything stop you. So I am pretty sure that you can make it. Um, Natalie, I heard that you went to be a flight attendant. Is that right? Yes, yes teacher. Okay, very good. Have you ever applied? No. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> oh, what is no, it stopping um, you? Um, my father are flight attendant. Oh, and maybe. Oh. Is that for eso? How do you say? He's maybe that's why. Maybe that's why I want. I want to do a flight attendant. No, but that is awesome, all right? That's pretty good. Yes. But let me ask you this, uh, because I'm pretty short. I, can, I could never make it, okay? But what's your height? ¿Cuál es su altura? What's your height? Um, um, 1.68 Oh, so you're tall. You're tall. Yes. Wow, <laughs> you're tall. You can make yes. it, girl. Okay, so I can do it. Uh -huh. And so I'm very so I need <laughs> Not kidding. So you have everything that it takes. In English, I guess it's necessary, right? Yes. yes okay. So this is the reason why you're studying English. Yes. Yes. Awesome. Awesome. So when all of this is over, I'm pretty sure that you can apply to become a flight attendant. Okay, that would be awesome. You have everything hey, it you. takes. So. I'm pretty sure in my 140, <laughs> I can never make it. <laughs> okay, so, okay, I'm really glad for you, girls. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Thank you, uh, teacher. Okay, no problem. Okay, I'm sorry, I have to go back. Let's go back to the, to the meeting, okay, to the main station because of the teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello. <laughs> Hi, I was in mute. I didn't pay attention. Hi, thank you very much for uh, coming back. 
Um, I guess we are missing some of you. As I said before, la hora no alcanza. The time is never enough, you know, to, to practice and, uh, and to, to learn vocabulary and to keep yeah. on practicing. So. But the next level uh, have two hours. Um, actually, it's the pro la propuesta, right? This is the proposal. Hacer como una migración de una hora a dos horas para brindarles no solo el servicio de la plataforma, sino más tiempo de práctica oral. So, eh, como los cursos que normalmente tenemos, right? So, eh, I, I mentioned at the very beginning, considerenlo, you know, tomenlo en cuenta, eh, consideren su tiempo también. And uh, yo sí lo recomendaría. Um, unfortunately, we didn't finish the practice, but it was so fun. I had a lot of fun practicing with you guys. Uh, tomorrow, we are going to review this. Y vamos a compararlo con presente continuo, right? So, si ya pasaron por la plataforma, estamos en la 5.2. Eh, si algunos creo que ya me terminaron, so very good job. Y si no todavía tienen algún tiempo para ponerse en ¿ok? Te, nos vemos mañana y seguimos tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Bye.